Hello everyone. Uh, my name is Rakesh Gupta. I'm a chemical engineer from IIT Kanpur, and uh, we founded these two companies, Mother Fluid Solutions and Abodex Process Systems Limited. Uh, we are into integrated, trusted solutions for critical processes. Okay, so this is our very first own podcast, and I want you to like, subscribe, comment. and do not troll right now we have a <laughs> lot of time for that so uh, looking forward to an exciting journey and uh, you know uh, i hope that we are able to contribute something through this medium uh, with 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 you and engaging a, a great uh, journey together so uh, this podcast what this podcast is about this podcast is about b2b industry space right you are in the core industry young engineers getting out of college right you want to pursue your career in this industry and uh, you may be a veteran but this podcast will give some value to you right we are going to cover a range of topics uh, first will uh, we may uh, have some topics around uh, uh, how a engineer comes to this industry b2b industry and make a career in this industry right then we can talk about some technical topics pumps fluids processes right uh, we can also have lot of conversations with industry veterans so we'll go look forward to talking to you know some of the industry people how they have made big time in their life and how you also can learn from them and then make something big for yourself also so it's all about learning from those people so i'm looking forward to talking to some of the industry veterans and uh, uh, finally we will also talk talk about some of the leadership skills so when you start here and you become a big boss and what is that journey and you know we'll travel that journey together so this is all about this podcast which is uh, what we will cover various topics so uh, let me talk about my own journey right uh, i started my career as application engineer uh, with idex corporation young engineer getting out of iit right that time 90% of the people they used to get a job in it industry first day infosys will come second day tcs will come third day wipro will come 80% of the people are placed but somehow a kida tha kida tha ki you know you are in the industry you have you have gone through four years of chemical engineering अब ये अलग बात है कि हमने उसमें कुछ ज़्यादा पढ़ा नहीं बट यू नो दोज वर फोर ईयर्स ऑफ केमिकल इंजीनियरिंग सो समवेयर दैट अर्ज वॉज देयर टू डू समथिंग इन द कोर इंडस्ट्री हाउ मेनी ऑफ यू फील लाइक दैट आई थिंक हु एवर इज़ वॉचिंग दिस पॉडकास्ट राइट नाउ इज हैविंग सम सॉफ्ट कॉर्नर फॉर द इंडस्ट्री सो दैट्स वाई आई एम शेयरिंग दिस विद यू सो केमिकल इंजीनियरिंग करी है आपने इंडिया में तो वेर विल यू गो विल कम टू मुंबई right that's what i did i came from kanpur to mumbai looking for a job and that's where i landed with idex corporation application engineering now the engineering that you do in college is very different from the engineering that you see in the industry right you have these great companies who are having these great products right but applications every application is unique and the role of an application engineer is to take these great products and customize them to suit for that unique application right so a sales person goes out get an application the application engineer really looks at what is the customer requiring and what does our company can offer now they have to understand the technical part so the first skill that is required for the application engineer is to really understand the technical aspects of it and there are two aspects of it one is on the product side you have to really understand what the product is and second is you have to understand what the customer really need what not what he is saying or she is saying right you have to understand what they really need right and then you find a solution which basically merge these two and technical skills is not everything right 
you need also communication skills because you may have a great product but if you don't communicate if you don't tell that how that product is going to solve the problem right you are not going to be successful there are 10 people out there who are offering the products the equipment right but the application engineer will simplify that they will talk in layman terms what that great product can really help solve the customer's problem so we talked about technical skills we talked about communication skills and the third which is very important skills that is required for an application engineer is problem solving right the skill is where you really analyze what all these aspects are and then apply your problem solving techniques to accommodate all that different diverging needs so these are the three skills that you need as an application engineer okay so we talked about what does an application engineer do but if you start your career as application engineer how can you grow further in life right what will be your career path so here you have technical skills you have communication skills so whether you want to pursue your path in sales in business development or in project management all these places if you have the technical skills you have the strong foundation from where you can really further go in your b2b space and life so uh, that's what uh, we talked about application engineer if you have your own stories please don't forget to share in the comments we look forward to all those comments and i'll try to reply to as many comments as possible so our first topic on what does an application engineer do and how you can pursue your career with uh, application engineer uh, as a, your first role now um, uh, we'll be uh, meeting you very soon in the next podcast thank you very much for all your support